ဆိုတော့အတဲ့ဆက်ရှင်းနဲ့လောက်ဖြင့်မလက်မှာကြာဆီမောင်ကိုဝေတွေရောင်းတာတယုတ်ကနေဝင်းတာအဲ့မှာ
we uh, recruited young people who want to make music, who want to voice their thoughts or frustration through music. We brought them together and then we taught them about how to make music together and also how to make themselves hard. Since then, you know, I've been finding out ways to empower like-minded people. This is not just another NGO office, you know. This building will be the place like where they can, you know, make the dialogue about the things that they could not talk in public or they could not talk with other guys. Like this should be safe and it's pretty much safe. It's safe with me. We don't have any discrimination here and we don't have any prejudice here. This is creative space for youth and also for the like, socially conscious artists. I'm a program advisor at Turning Tables Myanmar. Right now we are in our workshop, Bridging Divides Through Music, 10 day music workshop with 30 participants from all across Myanmar, from different regions. The participants are more into the songwriting and performance, preparing for the big concert. And this is where they are rehearsing. So the bands are taking turns. And we have all the professional equipment, our music instructors and sound engineers taking care of everything. Maybe you say, oh, you know, a music festival and music can bring people together. But to make it really work here in Myanmar, there are 135 ethnicity officially. There are so many, you know, bullshit happening, conflicts and all these like civil wars. All these ethnic tribes, they have their trauma or is hate towards uh, Bami's army for many years. So they ended up hating Bami's people. Like Bami is the majority of privileged people in Myanmar. You know, like we have this thing happening, you know, like people are divided, separated. Uh, they don't trust each other. So we are trying to fix this problem with this Voice of the Youth project by giving them a chance to speak up about what they're feeling, what they really feel about their own society. Yeah, my name is Sedu and I am a drama uh, of the band side of it. And I also work in here as a music trainer. What is music to us about? They like different like, religions, different culture. So everyone gathering here only for the one reason. Is it like music? So music bring them here together. Uh, at the first day, like they still like strangers to each other. But when we were giving them free time, they go grab the guitars, they start singing together. They don't even know their uh, names. So it was like, oh my goodness. It's beautiful, man.
today. Um, welcome to the concert, uh, Bridging the Bite Through Music. All this is uh, what you will see and listen to that. One of the results, six bands formed by the participants and believe in the power of music to promote social change. <laughs> Youth in general in Myanmar, they have been ignored, they've been neglected. That has something to do with the social hierarchy. Even though you wanted to say something about uh, political situation or social situation, I don't know, until you are 30 or 35, I don't know, people don't listen to you because they, they say, oh, you are young, you're stupid. So we are trying to change it now. So we are not trying, actually, we are changing it. ကျွန်တော်ကျွန်တော်ဟိုပါဘောအဲ့ဒီဟိုပါစာရတဲမှာစာရတဲမှာကိုနိုင်ငံနီးမားနိုင်ငံနဲ့တက်ဆိုင်
she saw, oh, there are different kind of people who enjoy different kind of music in a different way. Like Marsh Fitz and stuff, they were like, oh. But at least they saw, oh, it's part of New Myanmar. We can't be separated anymore. People were like, whoa, you could have been in jail like two years ago. You, you're now talking about it. be different by our taste of music, but we have one voice. We don't buy your bullshit about all these ethno-nationalism. There's a neurochemical called like dopamine and serotonin. Your brain emit this neurochemical when you are listening to music. Music physically can give you a sense of belonging to a larger group. You know, for, for a certain period of time, they feel like they're part of this. They're part of this bigger group. We are one, we are together. that, hey, you know, we can be different and we can be peaceful too.